Welcome everyone, this is Master's Joke, also Master's Joke 75 on Instagram. So as I said yesterday, I didn't bother, <laughs> I didn't bother watching the, uh, the uh, King's Coronation, because I, I went to uh, Milton Keynes instead, just, yeah, just, to, just to pop to the shops. Um, so I picked, up a few, <laughs> I picked up a few bits and pieces. So I went in, um, I went in lame, um, there's, it's, a, it's usually quite a good lame. But they didn't really have much, um, well they had quite a bit of Star Wars and you know other action figures like the Marvel but not really, not really um, as many as they had um, had previously. Like they've got, a, I think they've got Han Solo and the Scout Trooper left from the new uh, Black Series Return of the Jedi uh, 40th anniversary figures. But yeah in relation to the um, cheap, <laughs> the cheapies, the old peg warmers. Um, they only had like a, f a few left. I mean, one one figure that I that I because I like I do like this black series. One figure I am um, I am I'm tempted to buy was the Leia Bouche in the black series, and she's on the she's on the card, and it, she's she's from the same line that um, that, that Ed Ed sent me the the five oh first clone trooper. So it's from the same line. So, so I, I, I do like that Leia Bouche, and that's like eleven ninety nine. And then you've got Tarkin; he's eleven ninety nine as well. I was tempted for that, but the the guy I was looking for was because um, I really like Andor the series, and I like the Andor figures. So I was looking for this Imperial um, Imperial officer. So um, yeah, he was just like nine ninety nine, um, double points. I don't have a lo loyalty card. I've got no loyalty whatsoever to lame. But um, yeah, no, no, no. I thought that was a really good, um, a really good deal. And um, then uh, yes, yeah, so there was nothing else. There was nothing else to fancy. So it was not sorry, nine ninety eight. It was um, some of the some of the figures seem to have gone back to fourteen ninety nine each. Um, but I don't know. I mean, they're still like nine ninety eight on the on the website. So I don't know if you went up to the counter. It might you know they might tell you it's just a, a lower price. So I picked up one of them, and then I went to the. <laughs> I went to well, I went to the Lego store as well, but um, I went back to well, I went back to the HMV this time in Milton Keynes, and um, I picked up some of these uh, VHS uh, box sets T-shirts when I went to the St Evanage branch, and they're like they're, they're, literally they're six pound fifty, so they were originally twenty pounds, and they're six pound fifty now. Um, so I didn't um, I thought three was enough, but I didn't pick up the. Uh, I didn't pick up the Gremlins or the Back to the Future. So uh, when I went to the um, Milton Keynes one, I thought, oh, I've got to get them because they look so good. I mean, I've not bought them to open. It will be interesting to open one. So yeah, this, so these were 6 50 The Back to the Future one, it just looks amazing. I mean, it's all, it's all nostalgia. That's why I buy these things. And I got that in, in size extra large. So I'm, I'm, quite, um, I'm quite happy with that. So it will be interesting to see uh, what it does look like inside. And that's the... Uh, that's, that's a decent looking t-shirt. Not bad, not bad for £6.50. Let your eyes be your guide. So, I don't know. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to see. I'm going to open one because um, I, bought, I picked up another Batman. Uh, and the reason I did that is because it is size extra large. The one that I bought in... Um, the one that I bought in St. Evanage was size, um, was size large. So I'm a large extra large. So I plan to open this extra large one just to see the quality of the t-shirt. It's quite a nice one on there. Got the old uh, Batman 89. So, so yes, yeah, so I'm gonna open this one. I'll do that in another, another video. I mean, these have been out for a good couple of years, I think, but not, I don't think they're worth 19.99. Well, we'll see if they're worth 19.99 when I open this uh, Batman. And then I've got the, uh, the Gremlins, fantastic. Movie I watch it every Christmas with my son, um, and uh, this is <laughs> this is size small, so no chance there. But um, yeah, brilliant. I mean, one one thing that I did notice when I picked this up from Saint Evanage and also the Milton Keynes is that the it comes up at like nineteen ninety nine or twelve ninety nine, so they have to physically um, reduce the price. So uh, that happened twice now, but yeah, you know, they 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 know how much it is because of the big stickers. But that's great, and that's a nice, uh, that's a nice image of uh, of uh, Gizmo on there. But as I said, no chance. And they had quite a few. It says limited edition. <laughs> I just, I mean, I think they're great, but they're not worth twenty quid. Let's be honest.
But five, but five, what's it, 650, let your eyes be your guide. It's a no brainer. So I got them. And then I went to the, I went to the Lego store. Well, I went to the Lego store to get some, um, some of these new Disney minifigures that have recently come out, the 100 year anniversary. And this is one thing I didn't realize. I went to the Lego store, so these are £3.49. And I didn't realize that you can tell them what you want. So they know exactly what figures they've got. You don't have to randomly pick a load of, uh, a load of figures, but they, because they were unpacking them, because I, I mean, they said, oh, what ones do you want? And I, I didn't know, because I, I, really, <laughs> I hadn't really looked at the range. My plan was just to randomly pick some up. But um, uh, yes, but she said uh, there's still one boxing, so to come back later, and I didn't bother going back. So I instead went to, uh, well, I went to Waterstones, and they were selling these for um, three pounds, I think it was like three pound um, 70, or three pound 80, something like that. And I thought, I'll, I'll, I'll give that a miss. But it was interesting to know, because I, I didn't know they sold toys in Waterstones and, and Lego and things like that. And they also had loads of the... Uh, they had loads of the um, Packet 24, the, la the last series, you know, the pink ones, the last series of um, Lego minifigures. And I did have, <laughs> I did have a little feel for Chuffy Fire because he, he's interested to get, <laughs> to get some more uh, brown, brown astronauts and uh, space babies. But I couldn't, you know, they had a big box full, but I couldn't find any. But yeah, so I've got these in WH Smith. They, only had, they literally only had two left. I would have bought a few more. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to open these, um, I'm going to open these now. So let's, I think one of these, as I said, there was only two. I think one of these is, um, it's like a triangle, so like a wedge. So I think it's a skirt of one of the figures. But, you know, I, I love Disney. So this, these will look great in the, uh, in the Disney castle. So let me just open, uh, open this one. Right. So let's uh, let's have a look and see what we've got. And that is, see, I don't know, I don't know what the range is, but Do you know what? I've got no idea who it is. It looks like a princess or something. I don't know. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna build it, and then I'll see what we've got. I've got no idea who that is supposed to be, but I'll have a look in a minute. And then the other one, let's have a look. Oh, oh here we go. Look, I've, I've got the, the little list of figures, which would have been useful. Is that, that's, that's taped, that's taped up. Look, let, let me open the other one and I'll have a look. I'll have a look at the other one first. Yeah, it's taped up. But that'll be interesting to see uh, what figures they've actually got. But you can buy these directly from the, because um, there's 18 in total. Right, so this, this is the one that I felt the, um, I felt the, I felt the wedge of a skirt. So, I don't know. So I've got two, I've got, I've got, it looks like I've got two princesses. So let me, I'm just going to build, I'm going to open up the little, um, the little, uh, the little thing that lists all the all the different figures, and then I'll just build these figures. So I'll just be back back in a second. Well, so here's the here's the two figures that I opened. So um, I've I'm not an expert on uh, princesses, funny enough, but I, f I think well I'm guessing here because it doesn't say what they are. <laughs> I suppose you should all know really, but I think it's um I think it's Sleeping Beauty. I think I don't know. I don't understand the owl <laughs> and. Uh, I think this is, uh, she's got a compass in her hand. I think it's a, uh, is it uh, Punky Hontas? I think, I, I've never seen it. I've never seen the cartoon. I'm not really into princesses. But the other figures look really good. So you've got, um, you've got Pinocchio. You've got um, Jimmy Cricket, like Mickey Mouse. Uh, I don't. I don't know all the, all the characters. You have got the Evil Queen from Snow White, Stitch. That's the one that my son wants. And then you have got some Robin Hood figures. Um, and uh, is it Mul Mulan? Um, then there's that little kid from the uh, what's, that, what's that? That Mexican film with the Day of the De Day of the Dead or something. I, I don't know. And then you've got 
Cruella de Vil as well, the little Dalmatian. Now it's a good selection of figures. I really, I really do, I really do like them. And I, I'm, you know, I'm glad I picked these ones up because they'll look good in the, um, they'll look good in the, uh, the Disney Castle. But um, yeah, just a quick video just to show you, um, show you uh, my updates. And also, I've uh, I've had a message from um, from Amazon to say that my replacement um, fifth brother is uh, is on his way. So he should be he should be he should arrive either today because it was it Bank Holiday Monday today. But they use um, they don't use Royal Mail. Obviously, they use uh, is it Every? I think so. Um, yeah, it could be today. It could be tomorrow. So that'll be interesting, and I plan to send the uh, the battered one back on Thursday when I'm back in the office, so I can get it uh, get the label printed out, and then I can drop it off at the post office. So anyway, that is the end of the uh, the video. Definitely, these uh, Lego minifigures are highly recommended. But as I said, and I didn't know this, if you go to the Lego store, they you can just actually ask what you want. So if I'd known, I would have um, I would have got that um, Stitch figure for my son. And um, yeah, I think I, I think I'd like the uh, oh I'd like Oswald. He looks good. You've got I mean it's all it's all on here to be honest. This is the little um, this is like the the different figures you can get. So you can get Oswald, Pinocchio, Jimmy Cricket. Um, is it Fantasia, Mickey Mouse? I don't know them ones. Um, now it's out of focus. But that's the, that's the stitch that my son wants. That's not in focus now. Yeah, that's what my son wants. But yeah, really good figures. Oh, the Evil Queen. Yeah, let your eyes be a guide. But yeah, definitely worth checking out. Um, £3.49 each. Let your eyes be your guide. That's the end of the video. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. It lets me know you care. And it really helps the uh, the channel. Um, and I will see you in the next one. <laughs>